I was thinking of what to record and uh, came across something pretty good, pretty, pretty, pretty good. And it is called Sonic Riders. <laughs> I used to play this game as a kid and uh, I never thought about getting an emulator to specifically play it until today. I was so bored and I wanted to play Sonic Riders. And here we go. The full nostalgia, the full everything. You just you get everything with this. It fuck it, it keeps crashing. I have to like open it up twice to get the thing to go. It's because I'm recording, I feel. <laughs> it looks so fucked up. I think the reason why that's messed up is because it's an Australian game. Like, region lots. Australian onto a American BIOS? I don't know, I could be wrong. But that's what I think. As a kid, this was a bop. This was a major bop as a kid. It still is. So fucking good. This was such a good game. This game was way too good. This game... <sighs> game was just way too good back then. You just had to be smart enough to know how to play it. Because I actually read like a... Uh, I watched a review about Sonic Riders and the dude, the dude was pretty spot on. You, you, I never knew that this game got like bad criticism. Uh, because it was just too hard. Not It didn't specify. But... Whenever you learn the game, it's just so much better. I just wish there was like an online mode. <laughs> that would make the game so much better for me. Dude, the animation here is just so good. The one, yeah, but I guess like the one thing that's bad about this game and I guess I can agree on is the story is pretty lackluster. I mean, but it's a Sonic game. You really can't expect like a like a Last of Us tier story with Sonic. You really can't. It's pretty cut and dry. Blue Hedgehog goes saves world. Done. <laughs> Bam! I missed that noise. Bam! Start game. Did you want to create a new save data? Yes. Format. Formatting memory format. Create. Ho hopefully, I don't have to redo things. <laughs> um, start game. That's what we came here for. Dude, I missed this load. Oh, I get this main menu is the crap back then, dude. Right. Normal race. Um, no, uh, I wanted to do start mode. Start mode. This is what I came here for. This is what we're all here for, buddies and buckos. Oh, there's no settings, so yeah, start mode. Oh yeah, I forgot they put subtitles on it. I'll, I'll be quiet now.
so cool. So fucking cool, dude. This is where the story gets pretty fucked. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome everyone. I hope you're all ready for a show. We've got an exciting event just for you. <laughs> Since you all seem so bored, I put together a little extra something to spice things up. I call it the X World Grand Prix, a tournament to see who's the best of the best with extreme gear. Not just a race, but a special race. are no holds barred. All contestants pay a simple entry fee of one chaos emerald, and the winner takes it all. So, let's see who among you dares to meet this challenge. Eggman again! Just what is he up to this time? And there's more! Before I forget, I'll present the current contestants. These players, they're hot. The best racers I can find. Hey, that's... The X-World Grand Prix, huh? Let's do this! <laughs> yeah, this is where the story gets kind of weird, because it's like, it's obvious it's a trap. It's Eggman, come on. <laughs> Oh, and also, I did realize that in my previous videos, in my previous videos, um, God, in my previous videos, uh, that I was, that I had like a little thing popping up right here, and that's because I was using my Twitch scenes rather than my actual YouTube scenes on accident, and I wasn't, I didn't realize until <laughs> after. Yeah, um, I will lower down the game volume real quick, just a teensy bit. Okay, yeah, that's good. Should be fun. Yeah, that should be fun. Oh, dude, I forgot how to play this. All I remember is it. Oh, what? All I remember is that. That's all I remember. Oh, no. And then I remember you... How do, how do you drift again? I forgot how to play this game. It's been so long. I remember this though. You just twirl a stick. How does that hit me? What? I really don't remember how to get on the rails. Because you're able to get on the rails as a uh, as speed. Like that speed's uh I will get first. <laughs> Give me that speed. Give me that air. Oh, fuck me. I really don't know how to get on the fucking thing. I don't I try to remember so hard. What? 
the pit really isn't that good of a thing to get on, so I'm not gonna get on it. I'm losing my fucking lead right now, dude. I'm coming for that ass. I got sick. <laughs> what, you laughing at me? No. Oh. Thought you were laughing at me. Damn it, I got sick kid. I buy a fucking two micros. I don't even know what the fuck to call that shit. Like, I'm trying to remember how to get on the rails. I know you're supposed to just jump on them, but... I, I, I don't know. Yeah, but what exactly is Eggman really? Can't be anything too important. Hey, oh, yeah, it's <laughs> huh? Amy? <laughs> Don't tell me you've signed up too. Sure, it's really exciting and fun. Why wouldn't I join? Because you're a bitch. <laughs> and this way, I'll be able to keep my eyes on you. Cool. Tails? My controller is vibrating. I don't know why. A long time ago, there was a floating island known as Babylon Garden. According to rumors, that's the table shaking because of the remote. I don't know. It's crazy. Legend also says that the Babylon rogues incurred the wrath of the gods because of their crimes and that the island was cast into the depths of the earth. After that, supposedly the Babylonians were then scattered for all time, never to be found. But they say that the Babylon rogues' treasure still remains on that island waiting to be discovered. <laughs> there are also rumors that the Babylon rogues were extreme gear specialists. Still, how can a plank like that just float? That's easy to explain. According to the Cutter Jukowski lift theorem, the control surface flow is balanced by the inverse kinetics of the. Stop! Play the blaster. I get it, okay? It just floats, and that's good enough for me. <laughs> Wait, I don't get it. How are you just gonna say that whenever Sorry, you literally were on a floating funny. island? I remember this part. <laughs> well, I never imagined anyone would enter the race for such a piece of junk. <laughs> Thanks, though. It was good for a laugh. <laughs> See ya. Sure. <laughs> what a dick! Yeah, how can she just walk in and diss tails? No, and tinkering's all he's really good at, too. The next race is about to begin. Please come to the gate first, kids. Dude, I need to get this controller to stop. I'm waiting for this cutscene to end, Jesus. Alright, hold on. I'm gonna like, try to fix the controller really quick. Uh... There it goes, it's fucking buzzing again. Dude, the buzzing is getting on my nerves, Jesus. Ah. Uh. What? 
How is that not a drift? I could get the coins. Still flying. Okay, let's go. Right here. Right here. This is, this is it. I remember how to do that at least. I, don't know, I was never good at getting on the rails as a as like a speed type. I was never something I was good at. Oh, I mean I really don't need coins anymore, so I'm trying. I believe in you, buddy. Fuck me, go, go, go. Oh, they're, they're not even close. The game does get harder as you go, go further along, though. After this, though, because I'm, I'm gonna go and try to troubleshoot a lot of the problems that I'm having. <laughs> no. Alright, yeah. So I'm gonna leave it there. Because I don't know what the fuck we're gonna do. Sorry, see you guys later.